Uh, here we are with Dave Alderson, silversmith here at the Figa Show. Dave, yes. tell me how you got started in this business. Well, I needed a job, actually. You uh, needed a job. You were unemployed and just were young, a young, on the street. Young, yeah, that's about right. Young and looking for direction. So, I had uh, learned how to make some silver jewelry when I lived in uh, Edwood, South Dakota. And then we moved to California. And I uh, went to work for a bit of spur maker. So I learned how to engrave and silver solder and do all, do all that while I was working for him. And then about eight or nine years later, I decided to go to NRA school and take a class from John Bearclaw. Oh, yeah? Was that Trinidad or Lassen or where was Lassen? Lassen College, yeah. So, actually went up there twice because I had so much fun the first time. Second time I took a class was with John Vest. And, oh, yeah. uh, um, I, you know, I, I haven't heard much about him. Long time. Long, long time. But uh, I do remember when, uh, when I was uh, taking John's class, he mentioned to us about Vega. He says, uh, hey, you guys ought to get in on this. And I go, eh. So <laughs> I just kind of blew it off for a while, long while. And I just kept my finger on the pulse. I'd watch, keep an eye on news and what was happening. And uh, so I came to the Reno show a while back. And thought about getting back into it. In the meantime, I, I had uh, been on my own doing contract work, spec work, um, custom work, as a silversmith and engraver. Uh, I engraved a few guns. Uh, and uh, so, and then I was a member of the traditional Cowboy Arts Association for 13 years. And uh, then I've resigned out of that and decided I'd come and play with, play with uh, Fag and get reacquainted. So here I am. Well, now you went down to South America and studied with I spent, a, drag a shop. I spent a month in, in Argentina, traveling around the country, visiting the silversmiths, and uh, we actually went to school in La Brea, uh, learned how a lot of their techniques uh, and design, and, and had a great time down there, taught a workshop for a week. Made some really good friends, and I really loved it down there. And what kind of uh, engraving system do you use? Are you using all hand tools, or? I use whatever, whatever it takes. Hammer and chisel, uh, Lindsay, I've used Lindsay, I've used Hanset, I've used GRS, I've pushed. I started out pushing because we didn't have any air tools at the time. It took. I bet it took close to seven years before I had a, a GRS Graver Meister. And I bought a brand new one. Yeah. <laughs> and since then I was kind of switched off, gone in between, whatever, you know, whatever it takes to get the job done. What advice would you give to someone starting out? Draw. Lots of artwork. Learn your scroll work, especially when it comes to ornamental. Learn how to. I'm not very, <coughs> very good at, <coughs> at uh, scene work or anything like that. I'd, I really like to improve that. Uh, but draw. Get a pencil in your hand. Learn how to draw. And how do people get in touch with you? Well, I live in Twin Falls, Idaho. My number is 208-539-4013. Email is dave at silverchip.net. And I'm on Facebook, 
So, look me up. Alrighty, thank you a lot. Thank you, Scott.